Hey guys, welcome back to another edition of Lightworks Version 14 tutorial series presented by WBAM Student Television. Today we will be showing you the green screen effect, which is where you change the background of a video or image using a green sheet. Just like this. Okay, so once you've imported your files, what you're going to do is you're going to go to edit, and then you're going to want to create another track so that you can have one for your subject, and one for your background. So right click on your mouse, under sequence commands, go to tracks, and then hit add video. So now if you hit add video, you see there's two tracks, one for your subject shot and the other one for your background shot. So now you're gonna wanna create a starting and an ending point. So you're gonna drag your mouse, and then you're gonna hit the key I for the starting point. And then you're gonna drag a little more and hit the key O for your ending point. So you have the ending point and the starting point on this shot. And now on the next shot, you're going to do the same thing. Drag it along, hit the key I to start, drag it along, and hit the key O to end. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to drag both clips on the timeline. The subject shot will go on V1. So we're going to drag this along, put it on V1. And then we're going to do the same thing for the background shot. We're going to drag it along to right here. Okay, so now we have this shot and we have it on the timeline. We're going to go to VFX. Okay, to move it around, say you don't like where your character or your subject is positioned, you're going to want to maybe move it on the left or right axis. So to make it to the more rule of thirds. So to make it follow the rule of thirds, say you don't like it very much and you just want to move the position, you're going to want to right click on your mouse under add effects, go to add, and then you're going to click on 2D DVE. So this just allows you to position wherever you want your person or your subject to be. You can like move it around a little bit. Just I don't really want to move mine that much, but I'm just going to keep it here. But that's just an option if you want to move it. Okay. So now we're going to do chroma key. Chroma key is where you are going to want to have the green screen. So it gives you the green screen effect. So all this green is going to be replaced by your background shot that we have down here. So in order to create the chroma key effect, what you're going to do is you're going to right click on your mouse under effects, hit add, and then go to key, and then hit chroma key. And there you have your green screen effect, which we will soon put in place. Okay, so now you have the window on your left that holds all of your chroma, chroma key effects, and you have a bunch of effects you can play with. Uh, in the window, you can go to saturation, and you need to drag it over to a green place near the subject in order to give the subject the most saturation. Yeah, the most saturation. Uh, once that is done, you have you now have your background in place and um if you film your green screen and the size of your video are not a part of the green screen effect it's okay just search under dve and find crop um when you find crop hit the triangle you'll see the effects um left top right and bottom you can drag whichever side has the no green screen cap gap and you will no longer see the gap. For example, if your clip was on the right side, you would drag the key, you would drag the right key, or if your clip was on the left side, you would drag the left key. Um, now to enhance your video, you want to go to chroma key effects in the window and click reveal. When you click reveal, you can see the color is black and white with this effect on. You can see all the creases in your green screen with just a little bit of help from luminance hue and saturation, you can get rid of these green screen creases. Just remember to keep the subject completely black. Um, when you are using the reveal effect, if your subject is not completely black, your subject might look funny or have holes in it. Done fixing that, make sure to check around the area of the subject to make sure that the green screen is not showing. When you are done fixing that, make sure you check around the area of the subject to make sure that the green screen is not showing. If it is a little, use the effects remove spell 
and he softened it to take it off. All right, so you are done. Ta-da!